Hey guys, I'm back with some more. It's up sitting here in my secret base, which did end up surviving the whole way. We're gonna go straight to scouting today. I'm heading right over to that 100 square base to see if it's still there from yesterday. If that thing got raided, we'll look for a new target, but I feel like it's still gonna be there. Let's go take a look. Well, looks like somebody tried raiding it for sure. There's a bunch of holes everywhere. Let's see how far they got in. Oh my god, they went all the way to the foundation. Maybe they didn't find the loot? Yeah, it doesn't look like they found it. They didn't really do that much damage, to be honest. Maybe we try going in on the opposite side that they started blasting in so like over here there's a raid base that the clan was in harassing me from yesterday it looks like even it got raided or that's just how they built it let's set a raid base down on that side if we can drill through this thing and start rocketing it out ourselves try to find some loot really the only spot Oh, I could put a raid base because of the road. I'm going from over here. Okay, I've got one of my most secure raid bases ever down right now. Got a few extensions out with turrets on each side. A couple random turrets and then a few covering the top. But yeah, if a 4 plus man comes up with HP rockets, we're kind of done for anyway. All it really does is buy us some time, but it could be here for hours, to be honest, trying to find the loot. Especially if it's not on the first floor, which is what I'm going to try first. The one thing we have to make sure not to do is make a connection to that hole that they drilled. So counters aren't going to be able to land on top and counter from there. But yeah, other than that, I think we'll just start from this side. Make our way in, maybe even like on a diagonal line. Looked like the loop wasn't going to be over on that side because it's not armored. But the sheet metal doesn't mean too much. It's going to be a guessing game. Bring as many C4 and rockets as we can for this one. Alright, here's the boom I'm starting with. About 100 C4 and a few rockets. I've got some more to craft in my base. Just need to count the squares up to the breach that they made to make sure we don't make a hole in between them. I'm doubting the loot's gonna be like in the middle exactly. It'd be way too obvious. So they blew in 10 squares deep. We'll stop at like eight. We don't find anything there. Then just start hauling out the rest of it. All right, here we go. Let's hope we find some loot and not use every single thing here. tree in the base what you need to double check these are all foundies yeah looks like it okay that's eight foundations in i think we'll start branching out like each way it starts becoming hard side too over here the rest of these are kind of soft Start going that way and this way, and then we'll start setting rockets after that. Oh my god, that's a sleeper! Yo, did we just find it? No freaking way, bro. It was like in the middle, actually. Two walls that way, and it's the breach that the other raiders made. Yo, we're going straight in here. No chance. It's coffins. 
Who's TC? Is that all he has? There's no way that's all he has. Hold up, we got TC though. I can't believe if he's actually that broke, man. Like, there's no way. Um, let's slap a TC that will start looking through some walls. Definitely gonna keep blasting around where he is sleeping. Bro wasn't sleeping in the middle of the square. I think I would have gone into this anyway, but yeah, his feet kind of gave it away. Yo, was that actually everything? <laughs> That's insane. Dude had like a million HQM to build this, but seriously only had 30 C4 in here. Uh, I'm gonna break these walls just in case, but I'm not seeing anything else. Counter is finally here, but doesn't matter now. Okay, well, I think that could have been everything. Yeah, no point in wasting anymore. We saw TC and boom. It's so much more poor than I thought. Hey, at least it was pretty cheap. I'll show you guys what we did. So we blasted, blasted straight through the middle and then started branching off on each side. And it was right there, pretty much in the center of the base. They were probably two squares away, those other raiders. They would have started hollowing it out just a bit on every side, they would have found it. Hey, the good news is we've got plenty of boom to still use. We can look for another target. What if he's got like comps sitting in another random square? Not gonna be finding it very easy. I think we move on to another target. That's pretty wild though. I didn't think I'd get that lucky. Let's see how much upkeep was. Forgot to check that. 25,000 HQM. Jeez, bro. And 100,000 metal. You get one hour. <laughs> How does this guy have so much HQM? It's crazy. Yo, I was literally planning on that raid taking up like most of the night. But yeah, that was really quick. Unexpected. Also, kind of unexpected. He didn't have much in there. Or at least what I found. But hey, we got some time to look for a new target now. See if we can find a juicier looking base. I don't figure to find anything bigger than that though. What are these guys raiding? A raid happening over here. Dang, good luck with that. That looks like a base set to have its loot sealed off in a random square. I've already made a decent chunk into it though. I thought this space had gotten raided. Maybe not though. Been sitting around here all white. I think these turrets are still up. Yeah. They are. I think we give this one a shot. Definitely a lot smaller scale than the other one, but it might be more rich to be honest. Usually people are sealing their stuff off in this sort of base. Slap the raid base up on the water side, I think. Try going in from here. See if we can find the loot. Make sure it's not like decaying or anything. Yeah, it looks good to raid. Got the half floor, so he could have his loot below. Those turrets just like perfectly <laughs> don't see me, but they still will cover the top for me, which is nice. All right, let's see if this dude can be more rich than that last one, even though the base is a lot smaller. I'll show you guys the raid base here. We'll have extensions on this one, but it shouldn't take as long as that other one. We'll go right into the half floors just in case he's stealing coffins off there and then send rockets up once we get to the middle. It's like pretty open. Maybe just put these to level the base out? At least we got a spot to send rockets from though. Keep going in. The Jenny. I don't want to leave that up, man. 
Uh, I guess we'll take it down. Counters will have to swim up anyway. There's more power in here, okay. Oh, this looks so good. Was he actually living under the floor? At least some sort of bunker. Wide open though. No way. Can't be broke. It's gotta be in here. I don't get it, man. Was it like a furnace base? What? Oh, here we go. Yo, this is kind of sick. You gotta organize some barrels. Please have some. Hopefully, you crafted the rest in the boom. There's some decent comps. Oh, that's a lot of HGM. Yeah, I think you'll have some. As long as you didn't go broke on raiding or something. Charcoal. Bunch of charcoal. Kits. Here's boom. 30 C4, not bad. No insanely rich base yet today. M2s though, that's nice. It's super organized, I like it. See if he was cooking up any sulfur. I think all this sulfur got transferred. So, where's TC? Yeah, I don't know if finding TC is even worth it. I'm gonna take this door though. Let's see what's here. Let's see if there's a shelf. Might just be a jump up. Okay. TC is probably sealed somewhere. I don't think it's gonna be worth though. I mean, we saw all the organized loot. There's no way stashing other stuff. I mean, it could be. You have a half floor here to use. To look through the walls. Or not. This is the only spot without like something here. Maybe this is where TC is. Break a couple walls and then leave after that. I guess he could totally be stashing more stuff. Nothing there. Oh, maybe that's TC. It's the only hard side. I'm gonna finish that out. There's a counter here. And we'll leave after that. Yeah, it was TC. Let's go. Just scrap? How's that even possible? The base wasn't decaying. Must have just had enough in there. I guess I'll double jack through the rest of these walls, but I think that's everything. Yeah, let's get out of here. We're looking for another base. Looks like these guys got raided. I was looking for their iceberg base, but yeah, they're done for. Maybe the loot was all in the middle right there, like all the way on the first floor. I have to keep that in mind for next wipe in case they build it again. Oh my god, what are all these foundies for? What the frick? Oh, I'm dead. That base is insane. Need a new mini. Well, there's one spot they couldn't put foundies. Over here, near the train entrance. Kind of a huge weakness. I think if we kill one turret, we could drive a car up to this actually. Maybe kill two? And go in from here? Shoot down a couple turrets real quick. Alright, let's go find a vehicle. Preferably a four module so I can have a camper and a bed. We'll leave the rest of the turrets up for counters. Can't really put a raid base for this one. With all the foundies. Oh, here's a car and it's a four module. 
Yo, perfect. I gotta kill a turret just to grab it. Oh man, it's freaking covered by turrets. Is that enough? Might have to kill one more. There we go. Okay, we're all set. I'm gonna grab the boom. We'll drive straight up to the base with the boom on me. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Hopefully I make it past the turrets. We're pulling up on the base. Just gonna get this thing to full health real quick. we make it? Yeah, it's looking good. Use the car to block. <gasps> no. There we go. So, on these clan bases, I swear, loot is almost always one or two floors below the top floor. I think I'll go ahead and start going in there, especially so I don't kill the vehicle, like, by breaking this wall. Start drilling in. Yeah, we're going right here. Oh, we're on some sort of path? Any turrets in here? Yo, at least I can be safe. Can you find a door path? No door path in here. Maybe we're a little bit too high up. I'm gonna start drilling in though, next to where we went in. Let's try over here. some doors that looks like a loot room floor oh boxes I just realized I'm getting comfort. Maybe it's below. Okay. Which floor do we check? Let's check this one. We might have to blast straight down if there's turrets in here. Oh no! Dude, there's so many turrets in there. Thankfully we got the camper. There we go. We got it back. Very lucky I had a launcher in the backpack. The other one freaking despawned. Let's go for taking a triangle. Might as well check these doors too. As long as there are any turrets. Okay, we'll go straight down.
start killing turrets. A bunch of rugs. The loot out there is a sleeper. Looks like there's a bunch of turrets to kill. All these regulars, I only have a few incense left. Pipes though. Definitely close to loot. Can't get an angle. I'm gonna have to start using C4 here. I think we needed to have brought more rockets. Might have to go down. Let's see how it looks. There's the actual loot, I think. Alright, it's in there too. Only I could find power. That was a freaking foundy. Can we please drop in there? Doesn't look like it. There's TC! No way! No way, I just found that. I don't think we'll have priv though. Let's check. There's no way. Oh, we do? Yo, can I actually like be safe in here now? Hang on, we might be able to put doors. Just let me play something. You do that for a second. Okay, we're making progress. No, 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 no. Not the move. No chance. Hey. There's some power. Yo, can that please turn the turrets off? I think they just shut down. At least some of them. Oh my god. I think we did it. the power luckily oh here we go the loot room is like extended out here's the sulfur box and boom let's see what they got oh they're locked all right i gotta check this huh don't tell me it went through the wall bro what is that Yo, where's the rest of the boom? They have to be stashing on the outside. That's so disappointing. Oh man, I mean, I saw those TCs. I knew they could have been stashing. But bro, come on, you built this whole base and don't even keep your loot in here. You gotta be freaking kidding me. Let's see if they're even keeping their comps in here. Yeah, see all the tight trash has moved. That's no fun, bro. <laughs> Just stash in the externals. Unless it's in the walls in here somewhere. I'll look through them. Oh, bro. Yep, 
Yeah, kind of saw that coming. Even though it was a really tough open core, they didn't keep their stuff in here. Like, either in the externals, you guys saw the foundies out there. It could be in any of those external TCs or sealed off somewhere in here random. That sucks the clans have to do that, but it's just how it is on this server. At least we raided the base and got TC though. It's a pretty efficient raid other than having to kill all the turrets, I think. Yeah, well, sorry to leave it on a disappointing note like that, but not that I could do about it. All right, well, I'm going to have to get out and leave you guys with that for today. I hope you guys still enjoyed the raid today. Let's go back in the camper and get out of here. That works so well, though. Oh, frick. Hold up, I'm going to show you guys my loot room real quick. There's... Not much boom left in there, but you guys loot room anyway. Okay, here's what I ended up with at the end of wipe. Here's the resources, comps, M2s, almost out of gear sets, out of meds. And there's the boom I got left. I could have cooked up some more sulfur. And yeah, I got pretty set on backpacks, comps over here. Hurts and everything. All right, I'll see you guys in some more hits tomorrow. The server's going to be white bits, so it should be a pretty interesting day. But yeah, wish me luck. Peace.